Welcome! In front of me I have Amaze with Balance and I'm gonna show you how to enable the uh, font notifications uh, for this watch on the iPhone. Basically, if you want to receive the notifications, the app notifications from your iPhone on your watch. Before we start, if you want to receive the notifications on your watch, your watch needs to be paired with a phone via the Zap application. Once the devices are paired together, we can continue. And now we can open the Zap application on the iPhone that is paired with our watch. In the app, you should see the home page. Now we can tap on the profile icon, tap on Amazfit balance, and tap on the notification and reminders. And here we have the app alerts, incoming SMS and incoming email. Tap on the app alerts first. And if the notifications are turned off, turn them on and wait for a couple of seconds. And once you see some pop-ups about the permissions, because you may not have the required permissions allowed. So if you see some pop-ups about the permissions, uh, tap on allow and allow them. And now, once you allow the permissions, close the uh, app for, for a couple of seconds. First, we need to go back to settings, because I forgot to mention, we need to make sure that the required permissions are allowed. Uh, for this to work. So let's open the settings, tap on Bluetooth, and here you should see a Macefit balance. Actually, you should see two of them. You have the one without numbers and then one with numbers. Tap on the info icon next to the one without the numbers, and here you should see the option called S share system notifications. This option needs to be enabled. And if you allow the required permission once the application was opened, uh, this option will be enabled. But I recommend to double check it because uh, if it's disabled the notifications won't work okay another thing i recommend to check is to go back to the main page of settings uh, scroll down and find the zap app tap on it and here make sure that the bluetooth is enabled once it is close the settings and we can go back to the app so let's reopen the app tap on profile select the ma's fit balance tap on notification and reminder and then I'm gonna tap on app alerts, turn on the notifications, and as you can see here we have the list of apps we can enable the notifications for. And we have only four apps. This list will fill in once you receive the notification uh, from, uh, from the application. So basically let's say I receive the notification from WhatsApp or Discord, that app will appear right here on the list. Uh, so I'm gonna check if I'm logged in into Discord. I am not, so I'm gonna log in into Discord, send myself a message, and we should, we should see the Discord on the list and then we can enable the notifications for it. So... Okay, now I'm logged in. Now I'm gonna send myself a message on Discord so you can... so we can get the notification. Like this. We got the notification on our iPhone. Now, if we go back to the uh, Zep application, the Discord should be here but maybe we need to reopen it. So I'm gonna close this app, up, open it again, tap on profile, select our MAs with balance, tap on app uh, or other notifications and reminders, and then app alerts. And as you can see now, the Discord is here on the list. And if we enable it, uh, the notifications now will be popping up on our watch. So if we send another message on Discord, I'm just gonna write some gibberish. Like this. And as you can see, we got it on our iPhone. And if you wake up the screen on your watch, it also should be on your watch if the notifications are enabled for it. So that's how it works. Basically, you need to enable the notifications for specific applications for it to work. Okay, and once you're done customizing this, go back. You can also enable the notifications for the messages, text messages, and the emails. So if you want to do it, tap on the switch, uh, and the same for the email, like that. Okay, and once you're done, you should be able to receive the notifications and they should be working. And that's how you enable the phone notifications for this watch on the iPhone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.